Oh, we've got someone on the walkie talkie. Hello? You need to be quiet. Who is this? Who is this? I'm Clementine. This is my house. Hi, Clementine. Yeah, Hi. he's Lee. You're not my daddy. No, I'm not. Where are your parents? They took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in Savannah, I think. Oh, it's gonna do she actually blood this time. Where are you? I'm outside in my tree house. They can't get in. That's smart. See? Can you see me? I can see you through the window. Yeah. <laughs> Trip number five. This time he bashed his head. Oh, trip number six. Come on, come on, come on. Next. Hit the hammer. Oh, 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 oh. oh that's nasty. Whoa. Yeah, that's very nasty. Very, very nasty. Man. Hi there. Did you kill it? What do you think? God. I don't know. I think so. Sometimes they come back. Have you killed one? No, but they get shot a lot. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah, I want so my parents to come brave. home now. I think that might be a little while, you know? Oh. Look, I don't know what happened, but I'll look after you until then. What should we do now? Let's uh, look for help. We need to find help before it gets dark. Yeah, it's not safe at night. Well, it's not safe at night or day. Let's go. Still Stay zombies around. Okay, let's go. With my uh, crippled leg. And now a world record of trips in 10 minutes or so. Six. Oh, there's two people over there, which is good. Or two alive people, anyway. This sucks. Oh, it's hot dish night. What's the matter? Should I stay? What? I don't want to sleep in the treehouse tonight, but I don't know if I should leave. What if my parents come home? They won't. They won't. We should go. Then they'll find me, right? I won't leave you alone, okay? Okay, let's go. Hey, man! Holy shit! Don't eat us! We're not gonna hurt you. Yeah. Thought for a second you and the little one were both gonna give us the chomp. Sure. 
Do you know what the hell this is? No idea. So you've seen them then? Ow. You could say that. I'm Sean. Sean Green. Lee, this is Clementine. I'm Chet. We shouldn't be out in the open like this. How about you help us clear the way, and we'll take you and your daughter out of here and down to my That'd family's be a good idea. Farm. It should be safer there. I'm not a dad. I'm... Just some guy. <laughs> Just some guy. <laughs> some guy? Yeah. She's Just alone. some guy. Well, Let's get going. Staying put for too long is a mistake. What do you want to do? I... No monsters coming. I think we have no time to film. Let's just get out of here. Let's go. We have this double one of its freezes again. Which I think it might be auto saving. Yeah, it doesn't freeze, but it does. But what it, what it does, it auto saves something. Let's get the hell out of here quickly. Come on, just push it over. Okay. Go, 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 yeah. For just some guy? It seems like you saved a bunch of lives today. Yeah, I'm just some guy. Wow. We have just escaped the zombies at that place. And now we're going to some place. No sweat, man. I'll catch you tomorrow night. It was nice to meet you both. Yeah, well, we're at some farm, I guess. Thank God you're okay. And, uh, I was in really the actual series, there's a guy too. called Herschel. And that's him. I don't know if the Sean guy there is in the actual series. He might be. I'm not really sure. Well, I'm glad you took him with you then. He, he could be, I'm not really sure. I can't remember. You've brought a couple guests. Your boy's a lifesaver. Glad he could be a help to somebody. So it's just you and your daughter then? Oh, not his daughter. He's, well, just yep, some guy. Just some guy. Him. Honey, do you know this man? Yes. Okay then. Well, looks like you hurt your leg pretty bad there. Yep. Uh, yeah, it's not doing so good. I can help you out. Sean, run on in and check on your sister. You take a seat up on the porch and I'll go see what I have. Let's have a look. Yeah. This is swollen to hell. Could be worse. That's what it sounds like. Seems like things got awful bad in the cities. What did you say your name was? It's Lee. Nice to meet you, Lee. I'm Herschel Green. Yep, Herschel Green. I think he's from the series. Or oh, there's some guy called Herschel. Car accident. That's so. Where are you headed before the car accident? I was getting out of Atlanta. The news says stay. Yeah, well, that's a mistake. We hit a guy. One of those things you've been hearing about. On the road. Who are you with? The girl? Nope. A police officer. I was with a police officer. He was giving me a ride. Well, well that's a nice lie, but hey, who? I'm an awful nice guy. Sure you are. Pull up with mine. We got another displaced family of three sleeping in the barn. You and your daughter are welcome to rest there, and we're done here. I didn't catch your name, darling. 
Clem Clementine. Can't imagine what you've been through, Clementine. I'm looking after her until we uh, find her parents. Hey, Dad. So I'm thinking, first thing tomorrow, we got to reinforce the fence around the farm. That doesn't seem necessary. I don't know what you saw on TV or heard on the radio, but there's some serious shit hitting the fan. I don't think anyone knows how big it is yet. Your son's right. You're gonna want to fortify this place. Stuff like that doesn't happen around here, Sean. Dad, I'm serious. Lee, come on. Tell him what you saw out there, man. Uh, that got run over. I watched a man let himself get run over without blinking an eye. Well, do what you think you should. We got plenty of chores as it is. Lee and those folks in the barn can help out in the morning. We gotta do it. Really. I already said okay. Well, I'm all done here. It should start to feel better tomorrow. Well, that's good. At least I won't have to see that poor truck anymore. Go well, probably will. That's real. What do we do then? We'll probably just have to shoot Ow. you. We'll clean it, redress it, and you'll be fine. Okay, that'd be preferable. There's blankets and such in the barn. We'll be seeing you bright and early. Come tomorrow, which way you think you're headed? Towards Macon, I suppose. All right, then. Okay, let's go sleep in the barn. It smells like... Shit, though. I'll just say manure. Manure. Can't say that. Manure? Like when a horse plops? <laughs> just like that. Really? Plops. I missed my mom and dad. I bet, Clem. How far is Savannah? Pretty far. Oh. Okay. It looks pretty uncomfortable right there. I love you, baby. <laughs> <laughs> she looks like he has nightmares. Hey, get up. Mm. Oh, I'm itchy. Well, you slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. <gasps> but I bet your daddy scared them all away, huh? I'm, uh, not her dad. Name's Lee. I'm Kenny. Dad, we're in the middle of a fence. There's a tractor and everything. We better get going. So we won't hear the end of it. have a family now. Well, two of them. That's my the boy, family. Ken Jr. We call him Duck, though. Duck. Really? Dodging or quacking? Quacking. Dad! See? Yeah, uh, lots of the other lady. The word is you were on your way to Macon. My well, family's in the uh, family. Well, so, Macon's yeah. on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. Sure, we'll tag along. It's a plan, then. Honey, Duck, this is Lee. And, uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. Clementine. That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Well, we should get to work. We've all seen what those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. I want to build a fence. Yeah? Well, I need a good foreman. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On the tractor? Cool! Duck and I will hop to it. I can keep an eye on your little girl here on the porch. We can visit. Okay. Well, I'm actually going to talk to these people. Well, hey there, yeah. girls. You two actually look relaxed. I think we're doing just fine. Clementine was just telling me about first grade. Oh, uh... How's that? It's easy. Well, yeah. <laughs> so, you're good? Anyway, 
It's almost like we didn't see people eating each other for the past three days. It's peaceful here, no? So, uh, what do you do when corpses aren't walking around? I'm a veterinarian back in Fort Lauderdale. Like Herschel here, except more with dogs and cats and uh, not horses. What is it that you do, Lee? I used to teach up at the University of Georgia. We need to hope that we can go back to our jobs soon, Lee. Back to normal. It can't stay like this. Yeah, right. No, I used to. I was let go a little while back. Well, that's too bad. Well, I hear people always clamor back to college after a big disaster. People don't want to die ignorant, I guess. How did you handle getting through the city? Kenny just drove. We passed so many people that needed help, and we just passed people over some. Just, just... Uh, it's okay. It's fine. You don't have to say anymore. I want to go home tomorrow, but even then I can't take away the things we... the things Doc went through. Don't you want to go back to the moment before you knew about all of this? <laughs> 